Wesley McDonald of Louisville was born in November 2021, he appeared to be in perfect health. But when he was two months old, his parents noticed a small bump on his temple and questioned his pediatrician about it. And she said, oh yeah, something doesn't look right with the shape of his skull. Let me refer you to Akron Children's. It was at Akron Children's Hospital that doctors discovered that Wesley McDonald has a rare condition called craniosynostosis. There are two main bone plates in the forehead, two in the back here and one in the back, way back here. So five main bone plates that are separated by six growth centers. And in Wesley's case, one of those growth centers was not present and functioning the way it should have been. And so if the brain um, is growing and the skull does not allow it to, it actually causes a restriction in that area. It was very terrifying, especially because we were both new parents and we have never heard of that diagnosis before. Doctors then told Wesley's parents that he would need surgery and the medical team at Akron Children's performed the sensitive operation in October. To kind of make that bone in a more typical position and then resetting it so that the A, appearance is improved and B, the brain ha no longer has that restricted area. Well, that was very hard and I still have that image of him in my head. No one wants to see their baby like that, so it was very sad. Mm, you're yeah. driving? Wesley's parents were initially concerned when doctors told them they could take him home the day after the surgery. <laughs> and just told us to keep up on his medicine and make him comfortable and just give him lots of cuddles and care. It turns out that Wesley McDonald is a resilient baby and has quickly recovered. Amazing. I just think we have the best little boy ever and I just can't believe how he did so well with that surgery. And Wesley's parents are sharing their story in the hope it will serve as an inspiration for other families. Especially parents going through a surgery with their baby or child. In this time of year, it just makes people feel very good. So I'm happy that we put a smile on people's faces. Jack Shea, Fox 8 News in Akron.